Hello everyone and welcome to Trust Your System and Other Great Topics. We're going to be looking at uh, one of our systems, very simple, easy, clean, the ultimate swing trader. But more importantly than the system, it's about you, the trader. Okay, That will... <coughs> your trading success will hinge upon you. Now, there's a couple things I can uh, give you, a few tips that will help you along the way. So the first one is trust your system. You have a system, whatever the system may be, you back tested it, you trust it. Here we had a trade on the CAD. I lowered the entry slightly. Here's This is the entry that it gives you. It gave us 47 pip trade. I lowered it a little bit due to some swing levels. And, you know, you see we put it on here in the evening just look at it 10 minutes a night put on your trade it triggered in actually the next night so here on the 30th it triggered in and it went right on down to the first target okay great we have a risk-free trade now and that's part two you'll see that trade for profit manage your trade so here you have a risk-free you booked uh, probably about 37 pips, nothing that great, but again, you can how many contracts did you buy, how many lots? So, in any case, at that point in time, you take your stop, which was up here, and it moves right on down to your entry. It did hold the next night we talked about it in a live room, and I'll show you something on that. It went up, got one pip to your break even stop, and then last night, non farm payroll this morning went on down. Now, uh, we're going to talk about non-farm payroll and how you can manage the trade. This thing hit, basically, on the non-farm payroll news. So you already had a stop in. You could have maybe tightened it up a little bit, but you'd already made money, and you're just looking to make more. So, again, this brought in probably another uh, 60 pips or more on that second position. So overall, you made almost 100 pips on this one trade. It took one, two, three, four, four days. And that's on a 30-minute chart. So, again, if you don't trust your system, if you want to bail at any side of heat, again, there was no reason to bail because you had a locked-in profit. You're trying to make more. Let your winners run, okay? Keep your losses small and let your winners run. Let's take a look at another example or two of the system and knowing how to trust your system. I'll give you guys another tip. This is one of my favorite pairs, the EuroCAD on a 15-minute chart. Okay, so it's pretty fast. You do get a lot of setups. So here again, we had a setup here back on the 29th. Again, I adjusted below this swing low because I wanted to, you know, I'm willing to give up a few pips to confirm. It's, I don't want to get ticked in, and it triggered me in. It went, again, right down during the night, took me out at the first target. And then later that night, it went down and got one pip to the full target. So again, you'll have moved up. You already sold some here, and then you got in there. Again, just showing you here, again, trust your system. It gave you a nice long, no reason to doubt it. Hit the second target. Again, last night, another trade triggered in, went down to the first target, and second target, the non-farm payroll just really uh, kind of helped you out. But again, that's how you want to manage your trades. If you're coming into a report, you already had profit booked and your stop was at break even on the, s the rest of your position. So very critical. You could have continued to make this. You, you had no risk, so you really wouldn't have necessarily had your stop right up here. You could have moved it on down to try and catch a bounce off this 136 level. So, again, a great, great uh, uh, trade. Now let's take a look at another one, and I'll give you a sneak peek at my uh, live room that I do. Okay, uh, just to let you know, the next part of this is you need to have a coach. All right, so you're going to trust your system, you're going to manage your trades for profit, let your winners run, and, you know, keep always have a stop, keep your stops tight, you know, per the trade, whatever they're supposed to be, let the trade breathe, but again, don't panic. Trust yourself, the system, and a coach, okay? I do live trade calls every night with the Ultimate Swing Trader. It's a VIP room, and this was last night's post. 
Um, just talk a, a recap, kind of what our last trade was. Our euro dollar hit the first target. Dollar CAD was still looking for the second target, which again I showed you that uh, earlier, and it did hit the second target. And we had a trade that we canceled, so it never triggered. Talk about non-farm payroll. So you want to make sure you cancel any trades that haven't triggered prior to 8:30. That's my advice to you. If your trade hasn't triggered, wait. Get back on board if they're still valid. I had two trades. This was one of them. This is the Euro Aussie short at uh, 136.79. Our stop was up here at about 34 pips, and uh, then target one, target two. So let's take a look. And this was actually the trade right here. Okay, because it came in the evening. Again, uh, about 5 o'clock I do this update. And we actually gave a, a confirming, had a confirming one, almost the exact same numbers. So anyway, you make a small adjustment here, and it went on down to the first target. So non-farm payroll. Again, how do you manage it? 8.30, you've already hit your first target. You lock in at break even. Again, risk-free. You've already made uh, 30, 34 pips. You're trying to get another 70, and sure enough, it gave it to you right on down to the full second target. That's it. That is the power of the system, of trusting your system, knowing how to handle news, uh, leaning on your coach, having an advisor so that someone can, you know, if you didn't know how to handle non farm payroll, you know, ask your coach. So I may have one more example. Let me take a look. Okay, yeah, just a final one. This was the other trade that I called last night. It did not trigger. So again, trust your system. Don't try and chase it. This pair didn't really do anything non-farm payroll, did it? So again, we had our entry right up here. There were our targets. Never triggered in, so we'll cancel that tonight. But again, actually you cancel it for non-farm payroll, so a spike didn't tr just spike you in and reverse the other way. So this trade is essentially off and we'll look at Sunday night to get back on board. So again, whatever your system is, trust your system. Have a coach, lean on the coach, follow your signals. Okay, It may take three or four days you're in a trade. Let those winners run and you will be profitable. You'll break out of the you know, mildly profitable, I, I win some, I give some back, I win some, I give some back and you will get consistently profitable. You'll have a few drawdowns. You'll have a few losses in a row. But again, your equity curve will grow, grow, grow. Thanks for watching. Good trading.